North Carolina, Virginia outdoorsman. Like, share, subscribe, and I appreciate all the followers and support the channel has so far. Well, it's been a while since I made a video for y'all. And tonight we have a special occasion. My little boy here, Ryder, six months old. This is going to be his second run out in the woods. He's been coming along pretty nicely, so we'll make a video tonight. We'll go up with Wilson's Black and Tans or Ryan and Sarah and Elk Creek and see how well they turn out tonight. Hopefully with uh, Ryder here coming along like he is, we have a bunch of exciting bunch for y'all. Stay tuned. Keep up. So Ryder at the mint for six months old, he surprised me so far. He's done an excellent job on hiding scent drags, uh, treeing. He's just now starting to find his voice where he talks when he gets on the tree. And uh, it's kind of, uh, well, I guess it's kind of meant to be the way I wound up with him. I met Brian Wilson when he started working at my job. Uh, we just basically have been good friends ever since. He got me back into coon hunting, even though it was like a family deal. My great grandfather, he used to breed and hunt coon dogs. My great uncle used to do beagles and rabbit hunt. So Ryan kind of wrangled me back into it. We wound up going in together on a jib named Blacked Out Bitsy, who is one win away from being a night champion herself now. She won a uh, competition just a couple weeks ago up in Max Meadows, Virginia, with uh, Ryan himself handling her at that competition. So, Wilson's Black and Tans out there making some big moves and getting some attention. You want some pups, you want your dog trained, holler at them. They know what they're doing. But, uh, yeah, back to the pup. Ryder was actually out of Betsy's first litter. So, he was the run of that litter. Out of the 10 pups, Betsy had one female. And, of course, Ryan and Sarah kept her. She's going to be coming up as a good show dog and hunting dog for them. But, uh, yeah, Ryder, he's my boy. A couple people backed out on buying him. I decided to get him myself, and well, here we are. Several months later, got him on hide and scent, pulled the drags out through the yard, through the woods, going a couple hundred yards at a time with it. Been out in the woods once with his mama, ran off on her straight from the cut, started going out a couple hundred yards, started treeing. I mean, he's coming along very good, so I got my fingers crossed we have a good hunt and a safe night. And I know Ryan and Sarah both are going to be thrilled about it. So let's get out in the woods and let's see what these dogs are going to do for us tonight. Alright folks, look, we've got a nice breezy and bright night out here. So we actually uh, have a little extra guest coming along, along with Ryder. we got his sister Luna in here as well. It'll be her first night out, so we'll see how she does. And we also got our big boy Kane over here. I'm trying to knock a little rust off of him. It's been a while since he's been out, so we're open for a good night. Sarah, you got anything you want to add to it? get blown away, but we're going to try. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. All we can do is see what'll happen. Yep. So here we are. There is big boy Kane, Luna, and her first night out, and her little mate, my little boy Ryder. So let's hit it and see what these pups can do tonight. Oh, <laughs> oh Ryder here is raring to go. Okay, so you not mountain music. And riders right down in the with him, seventy eight yards. Yeah. 
Yep. And both pups are at the tree with them. <laughs> Come on, Trey, let's go. Mid hunt plate. <laughs> I got the eyes right here. Right above me. You're right there. I'm gonna watch that little sucker might jump. He's all the way up there at the top. As usual, Kane is on it. <laughs> Sorry, bud. Wrong time of year for that. It's pretty neat. The same tree that they got the coon up in the top is actually a den. So we know one spot to start looking for. Ryan, Sarah, got any thoughts? Hey, we got a coon? Yeah. It's been hard up here like one. Yeah. We got that in just a minute. Say what? About. 60, 70 yards. Yeah. Yep. Kind of nice, I like. Quick and easy. Pop's getting them a little experience out here, too. That's some puppy training. Yep. Yeah, you get that on the big jobs. <laughs> Yeah, fairly quick night, about 60, 70 yards, about maybe six, seven minutes from drop. Good night. Our little Ricky's all the way up there at the very top of that thing. Got to love some experience, so overall pretty good. And of course, we got to hear from the man, the myth, the legend himself, Mr. Chad Edwards. You got any thoughts about tonight, bud? <laughs> oh, yeah. Best kind of nights, right? Yeah. Overall, still a good hunt. Until next time, folks.